you know, when you, when you put a scrimmage like this, guys, I mean, there's certain ways you could do it. You could put all the starters on one side and then just let them, you know, score 80 points, you know, or you could actually try to get something out of it. So we tried to match it up where likes were going against likes. And, uh, you know, I thought, you know, there might have been some excitement by a couple defensive uh, ends or outside linebackers uh, after getting talked to by uh, Joey Porter. I think that helped them a little bit. And, uh, you know, having some of those guys back, you know, really, I, th I, I could see some good things. I think Shaq made some plays, obviously. Corey's a playmaker. I thought uh, Steve-O, uh, Steve Michael made some plays as well. And, and Daniel Nuosu came off the edge a little bit for a good young guy. I think that that really shows brightly as, as, as we move forward. Locked yeah, horns. they locked horns and, and uh, you know, I, I uh, you know, you know, I think that that was a good lesson for Jordan today. Okay. And, uh, that's part of the maturation. That's part of growing up. How do you deal with, uh, you know, adversity? Obviously there were some big drops that he had that, that, you know, really hurt, uh, as you're going forward, but that's part of the game. And now it's a matter of how you deal with it and move forward. You know what, the, and, and they'll be the first to tell you, the thing that made them was the offensive line. You know, and uh, now they had some pretty good ability to make a guy miss here and there, which is something we need to continue to do. Uh, you know, we really need to get some home runs, you know, from that position. Uh, there's one thing we're probably lacking is that, um, you know, just that, guy that can just maybe make a couple guys miss and, and maybe it's not blocked perfect and go make a play. And, uh, you know, Donnell has shown some signs of that. And, uh, you know, he's a guy that, that has that ability. And I thought Wolf ran it hard today. And, you know, it's we got what we got out of it. Uh, you know, we need to get Capri to step up and have a really good summer uh, from the standpoint of uh, the mental aspect of the game, because he does have some of that as well. But you know, I'm 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 happy with those guys. Uh, we need to get better. They'll be the first ones to tell you, and uh, you know they'll be bolstered a little bit by I think a pretty decent offensive line. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, that's a yeah, that's a that's a close competition. There's no doubt about it. And uh, there again, this is going to be a huge summer for a lot of guys. And, when you start to develop a program, one of the first things you need to do is you need to develop competition in different positions. And I think we've got some of that at some certain spots. We're still thin in some areas, but hopefully this class coming in is going to be able to help us with it. You know, guys, we held some guys, obviously, <laughs> that, that you know are, are guys that are going to play for us first down, uh, goal squad. Uh, next uh, fall. Uh, you know, a couple of those being corners. You know, and, and DeAndre, who had a hand, and, and uh, Bernard, who, you know, both could have played, you know, had it been the season. Uh, you know, we held Keevon on offense, and, and obviously Charles Lovett, who, as you guys know, was a playmaker and, and is a little bit of a game breaker for us, so we missed that out there. But at the same time, we were able to see some guys step up and, and see some versatility. I think physical corner and not, you know, those little tiny guys. <laughs> you, you know, the, the only guys I know for sure, uh, see those specialists, More than I okay, they're not only going to have beanies and weenies, but I'm not even going to give them a plastic, you know, fork. They, they got to eat directly, you know, based on that performance. So <laughs> there is no doubt about it. And, uh, but that's really a fun deal. I, I look forward to Monday. Because uh, you see the looks on the guys' faces that are sitting there getting scooped on a little paper plate, those beanies and weenies, and the other guys enjoying those nice thick steaks. Uh, that's a lot of fun. You know, uh, the one thing we're going to be able to do, I think, a little bit at, at the D-line is, is we're going to be able to keep guys fresh. You know, that's important, uh, being able to roll some guys in and out. And uh, I'll be interested to see. How, how those new guys did play uh, when we break down the film tonight. We're, we're, uh, we're a long ways ahead. We've got a long ways to go. But, you know, as, as, as I've said, I, these are guys that are, that are getting it. And uh, guys that understand what it is to be successful and what it's going to take. And, you know, a, a big step in that was having a lot of these former Rams back here, some guys who, you know, are hungry 
to get this thing back and, and get it the way it should be. You know, we ran probably pistol. I think we were in pistol last year probably 20, I think it was 26% of the time. Um, so, I mean, it's nothing new. It's something we've done at Alabama. Um, guys like it a little bit. Uh, must have been on those call sheets. <laughs> you know, so it's definitely something we've always had and, and will continue to use. Um, the O-line did great, man. You know, we're to continue, continue, we're continue getting better and better and better. And eat. when we have that type of mindset, family type mindset, we continue getting better. Where, you know, we love the new, uh, our plays and, you know, we're doing great in practice, you know, capitalizing on all, all, all our opportunity. So it's been a great time. I think the O-line's been doing really great. Yeah, I mean, uh, we're, we're family. So, you know, no, no matter if it's competition, we keep helping each other get better because we have different strengths and different weaknesses. So we help each other, but at the same time, we know it's competition and we work hard to keep heat in practice, which inevitably makes us better. So we do it as a family and we keep getting better each and every day.